the end of year 2021, the World Health Organization recorded 40.1 million HIV deaths globally, and Spectrum Statistics puts Nigeria's HIV burden at 1.8 million. Here in Lagos, the government says there is no stepping down on the control of HIV to ensure steady human capital development. Senior correspondent Jacqueline Ogo has details. Nigeria's huge population has made the country a carrier of a high HIV burden in Africa. In Lagos State, the government says it is battling to reduce the spread of the ailment because a healthy people power up a vibrant economy. It has shifted its focus to the highly populated Lagos Island to ensure people know their status. Persons who test positive will be started immediately on antiretroviral drugs free of charge to ensure speedy viral suppression. When the drugs are not used as prescribed by doctors, it results to full-blown AIDS. Iga Iduganro is the latest center of attention in Lagos. The people are being made to understand that sex is not the only route through which HIV can be contracted. The transmission of unscreened blood products to patients and mother-to-child transmission are also causative factors of the spread. Everybody keeps saying, oh, but well, HIV has gone, HIV has gone. This is the only way we can achieve it if we continue to do sensitization screening in all the LGAs and LCDAs so that the entire citizenry are aware of what the implications of HIV is, how, what the prevention methods are. The community dwellers seem to have acquired useful tips. I do the test once in a while whenever I see opportunity of doing it like this. If you know your status, your mind will be at rest. If you have it, doesn't mean that you'll be, you know, you'll be neglected by the government or whoever because the next person, the next person, the next person, you can infect them. It's not something that you should keep um, discriminate people about because it can still go. According to a 2022 statistic given by the National Agency for the Control of AIDS, 1.6 million people were recorded to be living with HIV in Nigeria. Advocates against the spread of the ailment say the government must not slow down its enlightenment campaigns to ensure the safety of lives. Jacqueline Ogo, TVC News, Lagos.